So we just uh, watched the Senate, the Kansas Senate debate, Senate Bill 32. Uh, they went to final action this evening and passed the bill 28 to 11. Uh, that's a great victory for Kansas farmers and ranchers and allows Kansas Farm Bureau to take the next step, which will be action in the House committee. Um, we're not sure what committee will be assigned, but that'll be determined in the next several days. This is exciting news and a great opportunity for the next step in, in this journey on Senate Bill 32, which is a measure um, designed to create affordability and, and options for Kansas producers and members of Kansas Farm Bureau in health care coverage. Um, so we're looking forward to what happens next and to continuing the discussion with the Kansas legislature. We ask our members across the state um, who have said for a couple of years that they needed this option and the, the opportunity for more affordable options for health coverage. Um, so about 75 folks came from all over Kansas um, just to share their stories with their members of the Senate to say this is how this issue affects me on my farm. Lots of folks will tell you in Kansas that 30 to 40 percent of their annual income is consumed by paying for health coverage costs and for the, the with, between premiums and deductibles, um, that's eating up that much of their family income. So it's making it hard to continue coverage and forcing folks to make really hard decisions about um, where they're going to obtain coverage or if they're going to have coverage for their family at all. Um, so those folks came in today and spent the day in the, in the Capitol building in Topeka talking with legislators and making the point that this is an important issue that matters and it directly impacts rural Kansas, rural families, rural hospitals, um, and their ability to stay on their farms and ranches and continue um, to produce food, fuel, and fiber that goes around the world.